this this time and white there you go we got the pinkish tone already and color too dark there just enough How's everyone? How's the weekend? We hope you're doing good. I leave some white space for the pinkish then this so we need some yellow and crimson and yellow to create this color mm -hmm. and blend Same thing here, and blend. There you have it. Good evening, good morning, wherever you are. Welcome to the stream. We are now doing this beautiful minimal painting. Alright, and here let's color and connect. Let's create a very calm and pastel sky tonight and blend. What's great about using oil paint is that you can easily blend, unlike with acrylics. Acrylics will give you a hard time to blend the colors. With oils you have no problem with blending. You can even leave it for, for a day. And when you come back, it's still wet. Amazing, right? And I want to make here a very light pinkish tinge of color with touch of yellow here. This will be our horizon tonight. There you go. And tonight's painting will make it very simple. And after that, hello, welcome to the stream. I am now doing this oil painting, a simple painting for tonight. Before we will end this weekend, let's take a break and relax and chill. I am now taking this burnt umber and touch of blue. I want to create a very dark color here and blue again mix it well and we'll color the ground area mm 
this will be our full ground and slowly make horizontal line there you go and we need to make some more blue umber mix it together and there nice and clean color I don't use black so instead of using black I use umber and blue like this one tonight I need to make it darker so right here laying down a dark color you can you know paint along with me painting sunset is very addictive so yep we will be making sunset tonight with few trees and yeah chill out now we have the foreground okay and let's pretend there are fences here so we'll make thin horizontal lines there and then take some dark color again and let's just make vertical lines okay there you go after that we can now add some detail with the, the sky how's everyone if you have any question feel free to message you can choose the chat box you know we can talk about life here we can talk about nature We can talk about art. Okay, let's create some here and then a few highlights, just a few. Mm -hmm. All right, there you have it. Very easy. Cool. Alright, now let's move to the trees. For the trees, we're going to use this one. Umber, touch of crimson, touch of blue. We'll create a very good dark color. I hope you're okay with the music. taking some linseed oil anyways for those who doesn't know linseed oil is the medium that we use for oil paint not only linseed some artists also use turpentine or liquid original for tonight I am using the linseed oil The cat is crying. Did you hear that? <laughs> That's not my... It's my neighbor's cat. Okay, there you go. And then we'll have... Let's say there are distant bushes here. So all we have to do is to tap 
drag and create some shapes and there you go again Mm -hmm. Okay, and maybe we'll add all right. So, in making so the, the trees, all you have to do is to just imagine how trees look like. And for now, let's see, like this going down. is too wet so let's take it gradually all right now after that it doesn't have to be straight you know let's make it as natural as much as possible there you go and maybe we'll add another tree here mm -hmm. and Drag and just the vertical line. There you go. And later on, maybe one big tree here. Alright, don't be afraid, just lay down and push your brush, and there you go. Mm -hmm. Alright, now we will work on with the branches. So let's decide which one is the farthest and which one is the closer. This one will make this closer. So if it is closer, we have to make it darker than the rest. Alright. And now, we need to change brush. I need to get another brush for that let me excuse for a moment all right okay i got this one this will be helpful mm -hmm. all right let me load my liner brush by this color and okay well, let's create a beautiful branches here so let's pretend that okay so the secret of doing the branch all you have to do you don't have to put so much force from here while approaching the branch I mean the trunk you need to push it a bit and yeah that's the time you can add more and maybe another one here and I need one here all right and let's make it a little bit darker let's add some more it's fine Extend.
let me load my brush. Alright. Hello, if you have any question, don't be afraid to ask. I'll try my best to answer them. Alright, and then... There you go. And let's have some more. Alright. We will create many bridges as small as possible. I want it to be natural. Alright. Okay. Slowly but surely. Easy peasy, right? Just connect from the top lightly and push it there. You would need to more lightly and push, connect. Mm -hmm. All right. There you go. Let's add some more. Okay. And load. Alright. 